Hello and welcome back to the Trading Card Game Card Shop Simulator. Wow, what a mouthful. This is episode 5, which is crazy. I'm having so much fun playing this game. I hope you're enjoying watching it. Plans for this episode are more licenses, more shelving space, more profits. It's that simple. The shop is nice and full at the minute. We're seeing lots of people asking for the fire battle deck and a playing mat. And the licenses for them is about 1,500 in total. And then we'll need another shelf to be able to store that stuff. So that'll be another 300 there. So we want to make about 1800 by the end of this episode to be able to afford them things, which I think we're in a good spot to be able to do. We're making about 800 a day at the minute, and we're a little bit overstocked at the minute, which should mean our stock costs are a little bit lower for a little while. So let's get into this and see if we can absolutely smash this out. And here we are, another day at Putzine Cards. We're all nice and stocked. We just need to check prices, and then we're good to go. Prices on these are holding strong, which I was a little bit worried about, bearing in mind the event we've got going. What about you? Oh, we can definitely bump you up another 50 pence per pack, for box per box rather. What are the packs doing then? 340, let's really ride that line. Uh, what about you? Have you dropped off or are you okay? Oh, we can probably bump you up to 325 actually. Just profit across the boards, chat. Uh, 2150 for sure. Market 1010, uh, 32 will absolutely leave you at 32. 31 it is. Uh, market 1010. 10. Uh, we'll go 20. 50. I guess that works. Uh, my machine is okay. Oh no, this dropped in price massively. Christ. 12.25. Good thing we checked. This is why we checked the price for chat. These have gone up again, so these are going up again. Cool. Um, right, that is all them prices up to date. Let's make sure we've got our best cards out here. 10 10. We've got to double check all of these quickly. Is there any thoughts on selling the expensive card? So, James, here's the thing I don't want to have to sell my really nice expensive cards like this one to raise these funds because they are really incredibly difficult to pull and it would be quite cool to try and have one of each card that we pull um if for some reason it's like making it difficult to progress without selling it i might bite the bullet but when we're like doing enough packs to kind of have a good amount of duplicates that are a decent value constantly i feel like i'd rather hold on to them um because just look what we've got going on here in fact we're going to open this because there are six there which is just like the perfect amount for me to still <laughs> oh, I can't make that joke. That's, that's a Bill Crosby reference. To me, it's a Family Guy reference. I didn't look at the cost of any of them cards. Can't do anything that good in that next one. Five pence, ten pound, four pound, and that can be sold. Mint, four pound, three fifty-eight. Not a, that's not a dupe though. Four pound on dupe. It's usually. 868 and that is a dupe which is huge for anyone we have 20 percent on the print we sell as well 330 that's a cool looking card i'm an absolute sucker for the foils you know but yeah short of getting a card that's like worth an insane amount of money i don't know how expensive they go up to i don't think we'd sell a card you only have one of um to raise money Unless, like, I was to literally put a card that is worth more than, like, everything I've earned in the game so far combined. Um, boom, boom, boom. Holy. Uh, we've not paid our bills yet this morning, have we? We'll do that after we've caught back up on this. Holy cow. Five... We can put some more cards out now. Yeah, look at that. 1050 for a single card. That's massive. We love that. Five twenty. So there you go. That's a 30 30 pence price increase on that same card since the last time we listed it, which is just hilarious. This poor prevent is doing bits for us. Oh. 
not sold. I swear. Oh no, I sold some of them packs. That's fine. Not sorry, boost. Oh, you come here, you smelly bastard. Holy hell. This man is trying to pull something goated. Gotta respect the hustle. Maybe maybe Shao before you come in next time though. Yes, good comms. Pay the bills. We've been so good at remembering to do that first thing in the morning. So there you go. We're already at basically 200 quid. Ba ba ba. Market. Ten ten. You playing some games first? This is fine. Oh, we not we love a booster box sale at the same time. Thirty three twenty. No, not three hundred and twenty. Wish it was. Whoop. Exact change. What a hero. Oh wait, we're level ten now. Does that mean we can we can unlock the first um comic book? I believe it does. No, that's level thirteen. I will stock comic books. Oh, sorry, sir. I was dreaming about comic books. Completely normal thing to do, actually. There you go. We can afford a shelf. So we'll have somewhere to store the items we want. Um, let's close that one. So, yeah. What we want is we want the license for... We want the license for this playmat and this fire battle deck. Oh, people are going to start asking for these sleeves soon as well. I fucking know it. So, yeah, that's a thousand. That's 500. So, that's 1500. And then to have the room to stock it, we would need another shelf. Sorry, sir. Exact change. You're the kind of customer we like here. Wait, how many? I am a damned fool. Okay. I've got so many of these, so I don't need to worry about any of them. I've got a lot of them. Sorry, sir. Uh, 71 pence. Boom, boom, boom. We've got so many rare packs, I don't know how I miscalculated so badly. Holy hell. It's alright, this guy's going to... Solve our problem for us. £125. What a madman. I, I'm also I'm I'm almost tempted to give him a fucking 25 25p discount here. Just huge, 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 huge. Um right. Surely there's room for yeah, there is room for you now. How many's left in here now? Eight. You know what eight is, chat? The perfect amount for me to rob from my own store. Pack time. Big box no whammies. 61 pence. 27 pence. 29. Didn't even see some of them. 219. For an order that big, you could have called it 100. If, I, if it was like possible to do that IRL, I absolutely would. Like, if I was actually running this shop, I'd have said, don't worry about 25 pence. That's a really cool card, that Wispo. Twelve seventy one. Some of these cards are really cool. This guy is absolutely pulled out with these designs or the artists he worked with or whatever. Apparently he wants to make it so that um, NPCs will come in and um, try and sell you their cards. And then like it's your job to like try and turn a profit on them, which would be quite cool. And it would also potentially be a cool way to try and like finish your collection out. You can make it like a, a, a chance that they might have like a rare card that you don't have. I think this should be the last pack I have there. I know that queue's getting long over there. Oh my god, there's still another one. 
Three oh four, that's cool. Five fifty one. Oh my god. That's a money pack right there. Holy god. Sorry, sir. I'm more excited for when they add the ability to actually play the 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 trading card game in in the game. He said that's something he wants to do. That would be really cool. Like you see a guy just sat at the table, looking for someone to play, and you're like, "Fuck it, I'll go play." What's good, fashion? How you doing, buddy? Have we not sold any of them today? We were basically sold out of them yesterday, and now no one wants to buy them. Clowns. I am very much so. Thank you very much. I hope you're also having a fantastic day. That's the kind of energy we love. Holy hell. Um, Might as well keep the shelves full. Not sold any more of them yet. Um, they can go up here, actually. Screw it. Get them out on the shelf. Get them earning. Going really well, fashion. I mean, I've been doing it for like price two and a half years now, um, but I enjoy it. It's good fun. We've um, we've redefined kind of what I'm using my streaming for more recently um, to be a recording studio. Um, no, I can't type fashion. I'm playing a game. <laughs> I I appreciate you asking, but I can't spend my entire time typing out messages. I'm afraid. Otherwise, I'd spend my entire time typing and no time playing games. Let's get some cards listed. Uh, this is just a deeper one I've already got there. Wow. Um. Awesome. Amazing. Shelves nice and full. This is definitely um, in the realm of buying the placemat license and a set of shelving. And then that'll give us today 15 to try and get the £1,000 license. I feel like this £1,000 license is going to keep running away from us. I feel like I just need to kind of bite the bullet on that. Maybe I'll buy that first. Thing that costs the most first, like when you like same for a PC. I didn't need to, James, because the one I put out for it was a duplicate, and if you've got something out of the same kind, it um, sets it to the same price. Look, see, they're both the exact same card, set to the same price. If you change one, it'll change the other. So if I just set this to one thousand pounds, see how it goes to one thousand as well. Ba -ba -ba. Duh, duh. It's not my first day running a trading card shop, you know. <laughs> Do we potentially take the plunge on the thousand pound? But we can probably stock the um play mats after this. Which is another revenue source. And then it's literally just get to a thousand to be able to afford the um no i don't stream everyday fashion i typically stream on tuesdays and wednesdays and then occasional weekend streams but over the um over the winter um weekends are a little bit more hectic um as we've got season tickets to the arsenal women's games and i watch nfl on sunday evenings um if you if you're looking for a reliable schedule the most reliable days are going to be tuesdays and wednesdays um I record pod I record my podcast on Thursday nights, exclamation mark cuts in convos. Um or actually it might be exclamation mark podcast. Um and then Monday nights is kind of prepping for the week. Oh my goodness, that went flying. You're saying do the maths, James, but I don't think I can know how much it costs to buy the item until you get the license yeah i don't know oh wait it's 800 
Um, so I started streaming on this channel. Do the mats. I said mats. Oh, do get the mats going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Got you, got you, got you, got you. I thought you were trying to be funny. Um, I've been streaming on this channel. I started what it would have been like March 2022. No, that can't be right. Yeah, March 2022. Um, then I started streaming on YouTube solely instead. Um, but then with a change in circumstance, it became easier to multi-stream. Um, so now I stream simultaneously on Twitch and YouTube. So you are currently watching on Twitch fashion and you will have heard me talking to James. He's currently in the YouTube chat and I am talking to both of you at the same time. It's great. It's pricey. I need to think a little. The hell you do. Well, that is a fair fucking price and you know it. Um, six. And it's going to be more expensive tomorrow and you're going to wish you would have bought it today. 9.22 I think is absolute shelf mats and then hope that we're going to have enough to be able to buy some as well. Got the light glass, nine o'clock now. This is going to be our last customer as well, which is mint. One, two, three, four, and 20 pence. Um, right, can we put any of these out? One can go there, two can go there. Everything else is practically full. We are out of green, which is a little annoying. So I don't like having none of something. So let's see what we can do here. Um, accessories. Where's the play map? How much is it going to cost? Oh, it's 202 for 16. Eesh. Okay, what we're going to do is go buy these. And put them um, not have green. Just so I can sell a new item. Um, and then tomorrow we'll be able to buy the shelf. This is the way. Please tell me your foot on shelf. It does. Nice. Awesome. Um, let's get a couple of cards out. We can't set the price from just yet because the price will update in the morning and that tells us what we want to do. Um, and then we'll be good to go tomorrow, right? We're 266 in the right direction today, which is a really good place to be. Right. How much did we make? What was our revenue today? Revenue was 900. That's, that's class. That's a really good day. Yeah, tomorrow will be a really good day. By day 15, we'll absolutely be able to afford this license. One million percent. Okay, let's get in here, update these prices, and then get cooking. That's an extra two pence. Extra three pence on them. Yeah, extra ten pence on that. Should have bought it yesterday, chump. That one's lost a little bit of value. That's fine. Might be a rare card. Yeah, I probably shouldn't be having rare cards on sale right now, but I will. Have you guys gone up in value again? Oh my god, it has. Holy shit, this booster box is getting nuts value-wise. I've, I've, I got so excited there, I didn't even look at the number right. 26. 75. These have gone up a pound overnight. Go on, what about you? We can get away with 350 per pack for sure. Uh, these have dropped down. We'll go 310 just to be a little bit under that 20% threshold. Market 1010, 2350. That's nice. Um, that's already been checked. Um, we will come down the next barrier just to make sure we're slightly under. 3250. These are going up in price quite nicely. Um, 30, 75, um, we'll call you 20, 50, you dropped a bit in price overnight, not the end of the world, we will survive, um, 12, 30, we'll call you that, oh my god, you've gone up again, nice, um, that is everything I believe, it's just, just cool. Get your asses in here. Right. So the goal from this day, from day 14, is going to be to finish the day with enough money to buy the other shelf and have stock of everything we currently have. 
We're not going to overstock, though. We're not going to risk overstocking. Oh, power bills. Um, we're not going to risk overstocking. Um, so that we can then, on day 15, make sure we afford that license. So that for episode 6, we are selling these decks that people have complained we don't have a few times. I think I'm being a bit too much a responsible business owner and not like living quite on the borderline enough, as this game probably wants you to. Um, but not my fault I'm good at business. Oh, my short changed him. That wouldn't have been good for business. That could have ruined me if that had got out. It's so funny seeing cards you've listed before with this pauper thing going on. Think, like last time I listed them three cards which I put out, it was two pound. Now they're two twenty one each. Nice. 1816. You have a good day, sir. Arsenal Women 141 final score. Emily Fox, Caitlin Ford, my goat. Mariona Caldente and Alessia Russo. Bunch of heroes. What card was that? Was that the £10 card? It was. Big money. Oh! Someone wants to flex the cash a little. Um, I think I'm doing alright at the minute. Duplicates. Yeah, we've got plenty of cards. Dun. Oh, you can do that that way. That's interesting. That's happening like for 13 pence. That's happening like for 10 pence. Which isn't a lot when you consider the way it's going. Holy hell, that's a lot of money. And uh, 58 quid. What a gen. These can go up. For sure. Bum bum. Oh, there's a swelly boy in the corner. How did you sneak past? Mm. Oh. The hundred congratulations, sir. You're the hundredth smelly customer I've cleaned. I bet your mother's proud. Two cards on a deck box. This guy has got taste. Mm. Just put one of them out, it's like that as well. Holy. This responsible owner right here, chat. Packs and sleeves. They want to protect them cards. Um, one, two. Da, 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 da. Lovely stuff. I only took one closest to me. There's already one of them out. It's fine. Yeah, it's so at the 450 range now, which is enough to buy the shell and restock green, which is good. So I think um, after this episode, although we've been in three episodes, I might do a shorter episode, which is just me reorganizing the shop, getting stock how I want it so it's consistent um, and stuff like that. I'm also considering getting another play table because it's a good little learner and it's it seems to scale pretty well. So an extra hundred pound a day, hundred ish pound a day by having another table. After two days it's paid for itself and it's just pure profit, you know what I mean? Just sold our first play, Matt. Nicely that was worth it. Um nope, not that. Um, boom, boom, one, two, three, four. Ooh. I bet you it lets me give them too much change, but heaven forbid I short change them, you know what I mean? Craziness. Oh. 
love. We're we're in a, we're definitely getting that license. We are absolutely getting that license. You can you can take that to the bank. That is a Connor Knight Garen fucking T. We're getting that license in this episode. I promise you, chat. That thousand pound license will be mine. Hey guys, can I play? So we're doing okay for stock. I'm not too worried about them packs. We'll definitely go on some more of these packs, which is fine. Do some boost boxes. I might just go down to three shelves of boost boxes, which would actually give me the room. So what I could do is go bang, bang. Then there's a two there. That give me a bit of room. I saw a smelly fucker. There you are. No. Please sit down. Thank you. Enjoy playing. Wait, was that an oh my god, there's another one. Sorry, madam. Uh three fifty nine. Oh, my bad. Didn't mean to try and shortchange you. Just kinda happened. I'm sure that's what they all say, but you're just gonna have to believe me. So yeah, we can do with some more sleeves. There's no way you actually only let me move one at least at a time. I can fit 20 of these on each one. Which means we are ready for another box of these. Okay. Stop order. I'm not going to order it yet. We're going to add the stuff in though. Just because that makes sense. So we're ready for another one then. We know we're ready for another green, um, which is you. We know we want one of you. We don't need more of you. We don't need more of them. So what am I thinking here? So we'll have the, the sleeves will take up then two bottom shelves. Honestly, just take £20. I can't, cannot be asked to work out 99 pence. Yeah, I've lost a penny there, but screw it. You know what I mean? Um, so yeah, we'll lose two there. Then they can go up there. You know what? Fuck it. That was a four pound pull up right there. Oh, this is a huge pack. That was yeah, like that that pack by itself is worth like three fifty, and it's worth ten pound before I mark it up another twenty percent, which would be another two pound, twelve pound pack. That's nine. That's nine pound profit, especially because it was no new cards. As a smelly person, there's nothing I can do to fix it. I'm so sorry. This is a stinky pack. That stinky person's walked past and made my pack stinky. I'm livid. Her, her stench has infested my own pack clock. I'm livid. What the fuck? We had one really good pack of ripping and they've all been horrific. I just need to get her out of the store at this point. Oh, that's a cool god. Come on. It should be the last one. Oh, gold foil, 87 quid, let's go. Please, for the love of God, get out of my shop. I think she's literally scared of customers. Yeah, I don't think we actually need to buy a new shelf. I think we can skamaz our way here by not buying a new shelf. To save more money and put ourselves in a better spot for uh, or maximising le profit to make sure we definitely get that licence in time. My brother in Christ. 
let the card hit the table. There will be no fighting over cards in this store. Need a cleanser. Almost bought a license instead, that wouldn't have been good. So we've got sleeves, deck box green, basic cards, cleanser. I think that'll be fine. Holy shit, my dude. One, two, three, five. Holy mother. Because that change as well. What an absolute mad lad. Um, we're about to be out of cleanser. I mean, I'm, I've put some in the basket already, so it's not the end of the world. Boom, that's that gone as well, which is beautiful. I was fully prepared to open it if it didn't sell, but it's what it is. Right, so we've got that. Having to do this one at a time if you don't have a box actually sucks ass. People were like, oh, we want this, we want this, we want this. No fuckers bought it. What, we sold one of them all day? Maybe two? No, one. See, that makes me nervous about buying this fucking thousand pound um, set, you know? So the green boxes can go there. And then once this is... I mean, we'll open them if they're not sold. Um... And then we'll be able to get the license. We might even be able to afford the license by closing today. Oh, wait, no, not with the order we need to put in. Dude, what the fuck? I think my day isn't long enough without you stinking up my fucking shop. Come on. We're not going to be able to afford it today, but we're going to we're going to do a minimal order to make sure we can afford it. And the second we can afford it tomorrow, the second we pass a thousand, we will buy the license so that we know we have the license. But it's more important to make sure we have the stock. We are already promising to customers. Do you know what I mean? This guy really um, ran with the joke that people in the card games smell. And was like, I'm going to make that a feature. This guy's a pack fiend. Gotta love it. You just know he's going home to upload about 12 grand's worth of FIFA points as well. Look at him. Wait. No, we've not sold another one all day. Cool. Not a bad price, really. I agree. Um, we're going to turn the light off now. Come on, brother. This, this dude looks like he's about to put some money down. Why oh, he's walking around back and forwards. Is he actually about to sit down and play as well? No, he's not. Okay, cool. Holy, yeah, this guy put money down. Don't uh, forget it. Exact change as well. What a fucking chad. Okay. We don't need booster boxes right now. We could do a blue, a yellow. But I think that's um, that's all that we need on top of what we've already got. Green, sleeves, basic, cleanser. And then a blue and a yellow. Um, blue and yellow. I've said that the wrong way around, but it's fine. Um, other than that, I think we're all good. Awesome. Not even half of our money to fully restock, which is actually really good spot to be in. Not going to quite, quite fill up the shelves. Oh no, it'll get a little overfill, I think. Oh no, it filled it perfectly. I didn't do math. Oh no, it didn't. Oh, five. You know what five is, chat? <laughs> We're going to have a couple of sleeves left over, which is not the end of the world. 
yeah, four sleeves left over is actually quite a nice one to have. So this is an over order. This is a really good order. I feel like every other day is like you, you're just going to inherently, doing it the way I'm doing it, have a little left over. But it's not a problem because then you can just, you know, not order basically anything the following day, which can allow us to buy our nice big shiny £1,000 license. Awesome. Um, cards roll out. Let's go, and then we can set price in the morning. Good amount of foot traffic today. We still made a profit of 300 quid today. While spending 500 quid, we're not going to have to spend anywhere near that amount tomorrow. It's good. Revenue in 900 is what matters there. Awesome. Okay, first things first. Bills. Paid. Next things. Next. Packs. 380. 480. Holy crap, what a pack. Massive. 112 isn't bad. Other than that, pretty stinky. One pound. 204, new though. 116, not bad. 1593, that's a cool card. Good value, but um, can't really realise any of that, I don't believe. 278. Nice. Ooh, this is a good pack. Oh, this is not looking good, bro. Ooh, 672 coming in to fucking save the pack. Holy hell. Right. No, it's not what I want. I keep pressing the wrong fucking button when it comes to the uh, binder. Right, let's double check these prices and then we'll get on with our day. 33.50. Is that another £1 increase from the previous day on the old blue deck box? Uh, 20.50 is fine on that still. Uh, we'll leave you at 19.99 just because that is a nice price. And we'll call you 30 on the nose just to make sure you sell. Oh my god, the price on this is collapsing in front of me. You can tell how much people fucking hoon. Um, we're going to really push our luck with them. Uh, we'll leave you at 3.15. Fuck it. We will put you at 3.60. Because you're still selling. So fuck the people. Oh my god. 27.25. Was that a £1.50 increase overnight? Oh, I've lost where I was at. Yeah. 27.25. 27.25. It's almost more expensive than the fucking um, rare box. Craziness. We'll just leave that exactly how it is. Double check these. Make sure we're not bending ourselves over. Yeah, look at that. Almost lost that in 20 vents there if we check the price. Another 10 pence there. Already checked that one. Oh well. Boom. Awesome. We are open for business. I'm, I think I paid the bills. Let me just double check. We did. Awesome. We need £514 to buy that license. We've been regularly doing revenue over £900. So let's, um, let's have another good day. Oh, straight for the box. What a mad lad. They don't give a fuck. There's 27 quid. These guys are rich. He bought, he's, he bought two of them. What a great start. You have a great day, sir. Oh. Smelly bastard. Do, 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 do. Nice little 15 quid there. Oh my goodness. Thank God we uh, booked up on sleeves, eh, chat? Oh, 
Um, and 352. Awesome. Nice. Holy. Oh my god, that £15 card was a um, dupe. What a fucking time to be alive. So last time we sold this, it was £8. 813. Mint. Buy 22. Another 50 pence been added on to the value of that one. It's, in, it's so funny watching cards that you've already sold and see how much the price jumps. 288, you reckons? Yeah, try 337, pal. Never sold this one before. Awesome. Only got one of them left. Maybe I should have bought more of them. Made 150 quid already this morning, though. 150 quid for lunch, folks. No, not 28. There you go. It's almost like they can see I've got a drink in my hand and they don't want to make me have to hit the face off. People play and earn money as well. Good. System gate number two. There's no way he's complained about something else. I've been working this hard to get the last thing they were complaining about. What the fuck's the system gate number two? Is that a tabletop? Yeah. Like. What? How much loan license is sorry? 200, 300, 500. So a thousand pound license is right there. Maybe after we get this um this this battle deck license, we look at some of the tabletop stuff. Because that will take up, and then we can have a shelf for the three tabletop things, can't we? Oh yeah, I need to put another card up. What was this? 308. Nice. Lovely choice, sir. It's a uh, 92 um, vintage, I believe. Expose me. 700 quid, 300 to go. Not even had our morning coffee yet. 10, 20. Brilliant stuff. Bum, 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 bum. You can hire staff in this game, but I feel like so far I'm doing just fine by myself. This do come to yoink the college for down there. I say yoink, purchase. Holy moly. I've done that in such a horrible way. It made my brain hurt, but it's 43 quid, so I'm not going to complain. This is fine. Fair price, I'd say. Stinker. Holy, this guy wants to protect his cards. Usually I'm the kind of guy who'd want to um, buy an individual card. Maybe I'll look at the table. There's some good stuff on there. One pence. Nice. One, two, three, sixty-one. We're almost there. Holy hell, this has just flown up all of a sudden. Twenty, fifty. How are we looking on the old uh, review app? 4.5. Absolutely fine to be at 4.5. Any higher might start to get a bit uh, full of pressure, you know. Right, what have we got here? You can go on the shelf. There's definitely some stock here that can get out of my fucking way. Blue boxes. We've not sold any of them yet. Red boxes. Not sold any of them yet. Yellow boxes. We sold two of them. Mint. Leaves, I know we've fucking sold loads of. There we go. Only 49 more pounds, and we get to buy the license. I do wonder why the license is so expensive. It's like the profit one, isn't it? Nuts. 
or is it just literally slow progression? It'd be a shame if it's literally just designed to be weirdly expensive to slow progression. In my opinion. Wahoo! I'm fourteen pound. Oh, someone's finally buying some fucking play mats. Hey, there we go. Ready, chat? Battle deck. Fire battle deck. Pack of 18 license for £1,000. And it is mine. It costs 400 quid to buy. Holy, that's our next goal then. We want to make 400 quid more today. Hey, we finally sold some fucking red boxes. 9676 Okay, lovely. Uh, dun dun dun. Uh, this is twenty fifty, I believe. Oh, no, not two fifty. Christ. Uh, one, two, three, one, two. I don't know if the battle decks are things that I open, James. I think they are just like, um, just predefined battle boxes. I don't know if we can open them. If we can open them, we absolutely will. But I think you can only open packs and boxes. And booster boxes, that is. Hey, there we go. We've got rid of a fair bit of the stock now, there, which is good. Yeah, let's get some more cards out. Okay, we're about to put a bunch of this card out, which means we don't have to set the price again. Which is lovely. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Okay, let's um, start putting what we need in stock. Um, at least then we'll know what we need. We need one of these. Honestly, we'll put one of these in. Because it all gets old eventually, you know what I mean? We need one of these. We need one of these. I think that's it. Yeah. So how much is that stock as we currently want coming to? 736 quid. Eesh. That might have to wait till next episode. We'll see. Guess it depends if we get any fucking big rollers going. If someone wants to come in and just like proper arm on the shelf of packs, clear it out. That'd be kind of cool. I mean, this guy's doing his part. 35 quid. Hero, sir. Thank you for supporting your local business. Twenty-one, thirty-four. There's a one, two, three, four in there somewhere. If you rearrange it. Um, got two more of these now, which means now I've set the car driver then, which was lovely. And we got you. Mint. More sleeves. And a nice crisp £5 note and change. Holy hell, this person wants me to do this restock tonight, clearly. Um, she's doing her very best. We're almost at shop level 11 as well, which is kind of fun. I mean... If we only have enough to buy the um the decks, I mean maybe we buy the decks. I just don't think I'm making four hundred more pounds today. I mean you bear in mind I already made like six seven hundred today. In fact, I might have made more that day. Well, I saw it down about 500. I got the work to 1,000 plus. I got the work to 1,300. So, yeah, I made 800 basically already, so I think. Good day's revenue has been 900. So, I'd be looking at like a massive jump in value there. Oh, we went up to shop level 12, though. That's cool. We absolutely love that. 
I'll buy a card. Do you want to pay a massive over the odds for it? Nope, don't even want to buy it. Shouldn't have mentioned paying over the odds for it. My bad. That's on me. I will learn from this error and improve. Uh, let's get a car symbol. Uh, let's have a look. So, yeah, you know what? Sometimes I just want to spend 60 quid on the same thing three times as well, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Definitely don't need any more of them. We're fine for that. New Orleans, Steve could probably do more of these. I'm trying to make sure we've got the right amount of stuff in there. So what's our what's our order looking at? Seven sixty nine. Yeah, it's not it's not happening tonight. This might be a coming tomorrow morning, pay the um pay the old um bills and then just earn until we hit that. I don't like doing like tiny little orders all the time because of the um the delivery fee. It it's like burns money, you don't need to burn. That's why I also like to over order a little. Like I'd rather have a little bit too much and not enough. Because then what? You just wait for it to sell and you can sell it. Holy hell. Another dude who is desperately trying to make this order happen tonight. These guys won the um, the new um, battle decks. Bad. Got to respect it. Got to respect it. Unfortunately, we've only got five minutes left. And that is... Lights out. They're going to keep playing. There is nothing else I can do over here. I can't order a stock. We didn't earn quite enough. But that will be the first thing we do basically in the new episode. Unless these guys are going to somehow spend 200 quid in the next minute. Which clears the shelf of the mats. She might have taken a few, few mats there actually. We'll see here. Pause jump. There's no way we're going to get like our second ever 100. I know you're looking for the fire battle deck. I'm working on it, okay? Come back tomorrow and I'll have it, I promise. I'm, I'm working really hard to get you guys the stuff you want. Oh my god, there is no way you've walked in after hours stinking like that. I don't care how busy your day's been. Fuck off. That is so rude. Walking in after hours like that. Christ, it was open for customers who were already in the store. Dip shit. Awesome. So that is it for day 15. Let's have a little look at our stats uh, before we end the episode. 48. How much, how much revenue did we make today? It must have been close to 1,000. 1,100. Holy hell. So yeah, um, after that upgrade, um, we were still profitable, which is crazy. We're a thousand dollar license, a little bit of supply, rent and bills to still be profitable on the day. It's a really good day. This is going to start snowballing pretty soon, and we're going to be earning some serious money. Might be time to get a third gaming table in. We're doing about 120 quid per day per table, and it's only 200 for a new table. So, like, that could be a good way to also supplement our income a little bit further. Also, hopefully, get more people in the store and try and get them to do some other bits as well. And that is it for episode five of the trading card game shop simulator what a mouthful that title is well let's come up with a better title for it but i hope you've been enjoying the series so far and i'll see you next time peace <laughs>